Hello, sports fans. It's me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke. And I'm here with a replay, another, yes, another Super Bowl replay. And this time it's going to be Super Bowl 30 between the Pittsburgh Steelers and the Dallas Cowboys of 1995. And as usual, I will take the um, team that lost the Super Bowl, and that was Pittsburgh. So I will be controlling Pittsburgh, and the computer will be controlling Dallas. The final, actual final score of Super Bowl 30 was Dallas 27 and Pittsburgh 17. But I'm going to see if I can change that, and Dallas will be kicking off to us. And we are receiving the kick. So should be interesting. I'm undefeated taking the um, losing team of the Super Bowl, my Super Bowl replay. So I certainly want to keep that going. And we have Neil O'Donnell out there as our quarterback. Not really, uh, not really uh, something that inspires. Uh, I'm going to go end run with Pegram. It doesn't inspire a lot of uh, confidence in me, but anyway. Oh, Pegram, look at him. Nice. He got the first down. All right, so we are going to, uh, we're going to go pro set. And I'm going to go off tackle with Williams. Man, look at this. We're running we're running rampant over this Dallas defense. Yeah, let's do that. Let's go line buck with Pegram. And there was a flag on the play, so we're gonna have to see what that is. Yeah, that was on us. Looks like, yeah, first and ten from the forty-two. Let's go off tackle with Pegram. And he still gets some good yards there. He, he picked up four yards. Second and six, I'm going to go out of the pro set. And I'm going to go short to the split end. Just out of nowhere. Let's see if Dallas is ready for it. And they weren't. Look at this. We're moving like melted butter through these guys. All right, I'm going to go short to the flanker. Oh, Donald's going to get sacked. Come on. All right. Well, now we've got to go short. We're going to go short to Hastings. He's going to get sacked again. You can't believe this. I mean, I can't believe it. I don't know if you can. All right. Well, now we're just going to go long to the split end. And there is a penalty on the play. Hopefully it's on Dallas. They're letting us play, so maybe it is. And they inter Dallas intercepted him. And uh, looks like we've still got the ball. So, all right. Let's go long to the split end. And now we're offsides, or false start. So we're just doing nothing but moving backwards. O'Donnell back. And it's incomplete. So we are going to punt on 4th and 36, I would say definitely. That's definitely going to happen. Dart comes out and he punts the ball. Hopefully it'll die. No, it doesn't. It's going to be a touchback. So, uh, yeah, Troy Aikman brings out the, uh, the Dallas. Uh, I'm going to go linebacker blitz. Let's just do that on first down. And it's incomplete. Aikman with an incomplete pass. Now I'm going to look for the run. I'm going to look for the run, and I'm going to key on Smith. And they do pass, and they're going to get a lot of yards on that. I guess I will put in the pass. Pass. 
And it is incomplete. So they got a second and 10. Dallas has a second and 10 from midfield. All right, I'll go to, I'll put in the run. He's suggesting the run, and I guess I'll go with that. And Smith does run it, and he gets six yards. So third and four, I am going to put in the run, and no, no. Well, now I got to. I'm going to key on Smith. Aikman back to pass. Let's hope that it's incomplete. And no, it is not. Now I'm going to run and key on Smith. And he does get it, and we do get him in the backfield. I am going to put in the run. Just the general run, looking for, the, for them to run the ball, but not necessarily. And now they're passing. And we are going to stop them, but at the four-yard line. So let's key on Smith on the run defense. And it's Johnson who gets it. And we stop him uh, for a loss of one. I'm going to go run and key on Smith. And it's incomplete. And now I am going to put in the pass defense. Even though he'll probably just run it with Smith. He runs it with Aikman and we sack him. Well, you got to believe he's, yeah, going to kick a field goal. There was a penalty on the play, so let's see what happens on that. I guess, uh, I don't know who that was. It was probably on us. So, I mean, but who knows? So, we've got a first and ten. Let's go off tackle with a halfback Pegram. Actually, the Dallas defense was not really that good against the run or pass that year. At least according to Stratomatic, they were. I'm going to go end run with Pegram. And he gets a few good yards there, four yards. We got a third and six. I'm going to go flat to the split end. O'Donnell looking, looking. And he's going to hit the man. Yes, nice. Gain of eight on that. Uh, let's go back to the pro set. I'm going to go draw play, halfback, Pegram. And Pegram looks like he's got a lot of yards. I thought he might get a breakaway there, but no such luck. Uh, let's go flat to the wide receiver. And it's incomplete. Second and ten, let's go short to the split end. And he's going to get sacked again. O'Donnell has got to stop getting sacked. All right, uh, you know what? I'm just going to go off tackle with the halfback. Get you out what yards I can, and then for the punt. And we will punt it. So they've got the ball first and 10 at the 18-yard uh, line, at their own 18. So I'm going to double team. I'm going to double team Michael Irvin and look for the pass. And, well, we meet him quick, so nice. Now I'm just going to put in the general pass. And there's a penalty on the play, and they got a big breakaway play here, and it's probably the penalty's on us. 
It is, so... Emmett Smith around the end, and he picked up six. I'm going to put in the general run defense. And we get him in the backfield. Nice. I'm going to put in the run again, just a general run. And we stop him maybe short. I'm going to run and key on Johnston. No, I guess it won't let me do that, so. But he's passing anyway, and he gets the first down, and more, and a touchdown. So Dallas, it looks like Dallas is going to take a 10-0 lead. And they are kicking off to us. There's 14.42 now left in the half. We just started, basically just started the second quarter. Dallas has a 10-0 lead. All right, let's, uh, let's go off tackle with the halfback McAfee. He got some good yards there, four yards. I'm going to go back to the pro set. And we'll go end run with Pegram. Got to stay with the game plan. And the game plan, man, yeah, Dallas always just barely picks it up and gets it before we can get a huge, huge gain or a touchdown. Uh, I'm going to go flat to the flanker. And he gets it. And he's got a nice chunk of yardage, too. All right, let's go off tackle with the halfback. Oh, that time they stuffed it. All right. I'm going to go... I'm going to go line buck with the, uh, with the halfback. Ooh, he got a nice chunk of yardage there. Third and five. I'm going to go flat to the wide receiver, Stewart. And he gets the first down. Nice. I'm going to go back to the pro set. And let's try a short pass. And let's hope O'Donnell does the short pass to the tight end. No, short pass to the tight end. And let's hope O'Donnell doesn't get sacked on this one. And he won't. And he completes the pass, and we're down to the four-yard line of Dallas. So I am going to go off tackle with the halfback. And he's going to score a touchdown. And now we're going to make it 10-7, I hope. Try that extra point. And it's good. So the score is now 10-7 Dallas, and we're going to kick off. That Dallas defense is really kind of, uh, it looks like, not very good against the run. And like I said, they were pretty mediocre um, overall. Um, I'm not sure if they were worse against the pass or the run, but they weren't really excellent against either one. But their offense, we know their offense was very good. So I'm going to go, I'm going to put in the general run for first down. And they do a screen pass to Emmett Smith. I'm going to do the run again, though. Second and three. And they pass, and that's incomplete. Now I am going to put in the pass. And they probably will run it with Emmett Smith and get the first down. And they do. It's exactly what they did. All right, I'm going to put in the run. And that time we were looking for the run, and he still got five yards. I'm going to put in the run again. And now it's Aikman back to pass, looking for his man. And it's incomplete. 
So it's third and five. I am going to put in the pass. And it is Aikman back to pass. We were looking for it. Maybe intercepted, and it is. I'm going to try to return it. And he gets it back to the 25, so. I'm going to go draw play with Morris. Oh! Oh! We fumbled the ball, and now they've got it deep in our end. I'm going to go linebacker blitz. That doesn't work real well. So they got six yards. I'm going to go, I'm going to look for the run. And we do look for it, but they get the first down. I'm going to look for the pass on first down. And they get the first down again, so now it's first and goal at the Pittsburgh six. I'm going to put in the run and key on Smith. There is a flag on the play, though. And it's incomplete. And that was on us, obviously, so I'm going to put in the run. I'm Smith. Whoa, we got Aikman. I think it was Aikman, yeah. We're going to put in the run. And he passes, and it passes it in for a touchdown. We'll put in the kick defense. And Dallas goes up 17-7. And they're kicking off to us. And remember, we have to kick off to lead off the second half. So... Nice return, though. Real nice return. Real nice return to the 41-yard line, looks like. First and 10 at the 41. I'm going to go flat to the split end. And it's incomplete. Going to go looking pass to the, to the wide receiver, Stewart. And he does complete it, and we get some decent yards there. Six yards. So we got a third and four at the Pittsburgh 47. I'm going to go flat to the uh, flat to the halfback. Let's do that. Incomplete. Fourth and four. You know what? I'm going to, I'm right here. I'm going to take a risk. I'm going to go pro set. And I'm going to go flat to the tight end. And he catches it. Yes, we got a first down. Gutsy call there by the new Pittsburgh coach. Let's try a long pass. See what happens. See if they can uh, if they pick up on it. And he completes it to Fig Pen. That was sweet. I'm gonna say yeah. No, no. Uh, I'm not gonna call a timeout or anything. Line buck with Pegram. He goes right up the middle and gets some serious yards. I'm gonna go end run with with Morris. And he gets some good yards too. Nice. Yeah, this Dallas defense, it just doesn't play the run real well. I'm going to go line buck with a halfback. First and goal. And we score a touchdown! And it, we're, it looks like we're about to make the score 17-14. And now the kickoff.
I'm going to just put in the general run. And somebody was, it was probably them. So they got, no, it was us. They got a first and five at the 26. Right, well, I'm definitely putting in the run now. And another penalty. Unbelievable. All right, but this time it was on them. Good. 107 left. They got a first and 10 at their own 21. And I'm going to go, I'm going to, I'm going to look for the pass, I guess, with a minute left. He's probably got a pass to move this ball. And we do stop him, but he's got a second and four because he got six yards there. I'm going to put in the pass. And he does, is it incomplete? It is. So third and four at the Dallas 27. If we can stop him here, well, we'll see what happens. There's only 30 seconds left in the half. And they run the ball, and they get the first down. There's only 22 seconds left, so. And we had the pass defense in. 15 seconds left. Doesn't look like he's likely to score. But there's another penalty. It is incomplete. I'm just going to put in the balanced... He gets out of bounds, but I don't know if it... No, there's one second left. And they're going to try a field goal. This is going to be a long one. Let's put in the kick block. Chris Bonio! Looks like he's going to miss the field goal. And he does. So, 17-14, and we're starting the second half of the ball game, folks. 17-14, and we're kicking off the Dallas. So I'm keeping it close. But, I mean, Dallas, it seems like they score every time they have the ball. So uh, I'm going to put in the, I'm going to put in the pass. And they run. And that's pretty good considering that they were running. Um, I'm going to put in the, uh, I'm going to put in the pass again. I mean, just once, I'd like to stop them, you know? And we don't, and Aikman gets tons of yards bootlegging out of the uh, backfield. Put in the pass again. And it's incomplete. So we got a second and four. I'm going to run. I'm going to put in the run defense. He does run, but we don't stop him. It doesn't look like and we didn't. First and ten, I'm going to key on Smith. And there is a penalty on the play, I'm guessing, on us. No, it was on them, I suppose. So, I'm going to put in the pass. And Aikman is back to pass. And it's incomplete. So... He's got a second and 10 at R35. I'm going to run and key on Smith. And he runs it with Smith, and we do nail him in the backfield. So now, third and 11, I'm putting in the pass. Definitely. Looks like it'll be incomplete, and so now they may try a long field goal. No, they're going to, they bring in uh, Jet to, to punt the ball. Coffin corner, but it doesn't work, and we're going to get the ball at the 25. So if we can work it down now, we're in, we're in pretty good shape. I'm going to go end run with Pegram. And we do get five yards on that. I'm going to go back to the... Uh, I'm going to go back to the pro set. And we're going to go off tackle with Williams. Oh, they stuffed him. 
All right, I'm going to go end run with a halfback Pegram on third and five. They shouldn't even be looking for this. And they're not, and we get a ton of yards. Oh! Don't tell me he got it. Yes, he did. Unreal, we fumbled twice. And he's not, I mean, not only does he move the ball every time down the field and score, but he doesn't even have a turnover. He doesn't get picked off. He doesn't fumble. Wait a minute. I'm just going to fall on the ball. Yeah, all right. So that's the first time that's happened in our favor. All right, we got a first and 10 now at the Pittsburgh 32. And if we could stop turning the ball over and making stupid mistakes, it would be great. We're going to go off tackle with Pegram. But they, uh, they, they hemmed it up pretty good. All right, I'm going to go flat to the split end. And he hits him, and he's going to hit him for a first down. Nice. Sweet, sweet, sweet. I'm going to go line buck with the halfback, Pegram. And he gets a few yards, too. Second and eight. Um, I'm going to go and run with Pegram. Man, this Dallas defense is horrible against the run. All right, I'm going to go line buck with the fullback Williams on third and one. And he gets the first down. I mean, he just barely got it, but that's all we needed him to do. We got a first and 10 at Dallas is 44 with 537 left in the third period. I'm going to do a look in pass to the tight end. And he's going to get the first down. That's it. Keep moving the chains. Uh, line buck with the halfback Pegram. And he gets stuck quickly. I'm going to go short to the split end. And he catches it, and he makes a first down. And we're in field goal range, so if we don't turn the ball over, knock on wood, we can tie the game. I'm going to go look in pass to the split end. And he catches it, and he's close to a first down. Got a second and one. I think I'm going to go to the, since we only have to get a yard, I am going to go to the pro set and try to pass it into the end zone on this down to the flanker. And it's incomplete. All right. So third and one. Yeah, let's go line buck with a halfback. And he's going to score. No, he doesn't. They get him at the one. We got a first and goal at the Dallas one. You got to believe we're going to score on that. Uh, let's go line buck with the fullback McAfee. And he gets held up at the one. All right, line buck with Morris. And he gets, oh my God. All right. Third and goal. I'm still doing the line buck. I mean, you're not going to stop me. And he does finally get the touchdown, and we go ahead. I'm going to kick the extra point. And it's, they blocked it. Unbelievable. So we're only ahead 20 to 17. So yeah, I mean, you know, we're doing we're doing pretty well, but it, I really wish we had made that extra point and put them up or put us put ourselves up by more than just a field goal. But we'll kick off to them. There is only 58 seconds left in the uh, third quarter, so the game is moving along nicely. And what a return! What a return! 
So that's a punter that made that tack? Anyway, they, Dallas ends up now. They got a first and 10 at the 49. And of course, with the fact that I can't stop them. All right. Well, they don't get a lot of yards there. Just three. I'm going to run and key on Williams. No, he's passing. Probably should have known that with Williams in. And he gets big yards, of course. Um, we're going to put in the pass defense. And Aikman is back to pass. And it's incomplete. Second and ten, we're going to put in the pass. And Aikman is back to pass. And we stop him right where he catches the ball. So they got a third and four. We can stop him here, they'll kick a field goal. He is back to pass, and we had the pass defense in. And it's intercepted. You gotta love that. I am just going to keep the ball. And that's like the first time we've stopped him. I think. No, we did get a fumble recovery, but I mean it's sad that we can't just stop him, you know? But anyway, we're going to go off tackle with the halfback because we're in the fourth quarter now, 13.50 left in the game, and he gets some good yards. I'm going to go end run with the halfback, Pegram. And Pegram gets serious yards there. So we have a first and 10 at the Pittsburgh 33. I'm going to go end run with Pegram. I mean, until Dallas can stop this, I'm going to keep doing it, especially since it gets a lot of yards. So, let's go looking past to the split end. Hey, was that incomplete? Yeah, it is incomplete. You got a second and ten. I'm going to go flat to the wide receiver. And he catches it, and he gets some good yards, too. And we have a third and four at the Dallas 47. You know what? I really... I'm going to go to the pro set, and I'm going to go end run with Pegram. They should be looking for the pass. And they are, and he's going to get a first down and a lot more. So we got a first and 10 at the Dallas 33. Got to go off tackle with a halfback. This would, if we can score a touchdown here, puts us up by two scores. And I think we would have a, a lock. Second and 10 at the Dallas 33, but let's first worry about getting that score. So we're going to do a short pass to the flanker. O'Donnell's going to get sacked again. Unbelievable. All right. Third and 19 at the Dallas 42. I'm just going to do a short pass to the wide receiver. Let's hope it somewhat works. It doesn't. Yeah, we're going to punt. Should have done a coffin corner, but. All right, so Dallas will have it first and 10 at the 25. Putting in the pass defense. And he runs it, and we do stuff him pretty quickly. That's nice. We're going to put in the pass again, man. And we stop him as soon as he catches it. So third and four, I am definitely putting in the pass. And we it looks like we stopped him. So So this is the first time I think that we've ever really stopped him. Like stopped him without him turning the ball over. So Jet into punt. 
Oh no, this has got to be the second, at least the second time, because I remember Jet was punting before. I'm going to catch the ball and run with it. And that and that's a hell of a return. Look at this. This is a great return. Hastings is going to return the punt for a touchdown. Pittsburgh touchdown on the punt return. I guess Dallas' special teams weren't that great either. With only 7.39 left. Now remember what I told you. The score right now is 27 to 20, or 27 to 17 Pittsburgh. But the actual score of the game was 27-17 Dallas. So again, this is another situation where we're going we're getting the similar score, but the wrong team wins. And Dallas returns the ball to their own 30 where they'll have a first and 10, and we're going to put in the pass now because, I mean, there's 723 left. And he runs it with Smith. What is he thinking about? All right, so I'm going to put in the pass defense. And we don't stop him. We were – why weren't we on top of that? All right, so he, I'm going to put in the pass again. 632 left. Aikman back looking for somebody, and we stop him quickly. It's Johnson, too. So we get a – there's a second and six at the Pittsburgh 44. I'm going to put in the pass defense. And it's incomplete. So he's got a third and six. I'm putting in the pass. We're up by two scores, so – and that's incomplete. Let's see what he does. Yeah, he's got to keep that offense out there. 522 left. I'm putting in the pass defense. Aikman is back to pass. And it's incomplete. We take over on downs. Nice. I'm going to go end run with the halfback, Pegram. And Pegram gets a ton of yards, of course. Second and two. I'm going to go line buck with the halfback. And we do get the first down, so now I'm going to go flat pass to the tight end. And it's incomplete. So 328 left in the game. We're up 27-17. Second and 10. I'm going to go short to the split end. Quick pass, and it's incomplete. So, we got a third and ten. I'm, I'm just going to go end run with the halfback. He's not going to be looking for it, and they're terrible against the run. But this time they do hem it up. Okay, I'm going to punt, and I'm going to do a coffin corner. And there is a penalty on the play. And that wasn't even a coffin corner punt. So he has a first and 10 at the Dallas 23. All right, whatever. I'll put in the pass defense. 215 left in the game. Aikman back looking. And I don't know if that was even complete. It was, it was for a yard, apparently. So we're going to put in the pass defense. And it's incomplete. So he's got a third and nine. I'm putting in the pass. Eight minutes back to pass. Looking for somebody. And it's incomplete. So he's got a fourth and nine. I am going to... Pass and double team Irvin. Aikman back. And it's incomplete. We'll take over on downs there. Thank you very much. A minute 37 left. I'm going to go line buck with a halfback. And he gets, uh, well, he gets some good yards. I'm going to go... Line buck with the fullback, McAfee. We 
We got a third and two. I am going to go off tackle with the halfback Morris. And he gets the first down. So we got a first and 10 at the Dallas 14 with a minute 15 left. Let's see if we can pass it into the end zone to the tight end. And we can. So we got a second and 10 at the Dallas 14. I'm going to go uh, short to the halfback. O'Donnell back. Incomplete. Third and 10, I'm doing a draw play with the halfback. And he does not get the first down, but we're going to kick the field goal, obviously. And we miss it. He misses the field goal attempt from that close. Unbelievable. All right, well, we're going to put in the pass defense. I mean, that's clearly what he has to do with only eight seconds left. And we got him in bounds. And that's the game, folks. So let's take a look at the, uh, anybody that's interested, let's take a look at the stats. Take a look at the box score here. So the score ended up being exactly the same as in real life, except that the other team won. And that was us, 27-17. O'Donnell was 13 of 24 for 157 yards and um, no touchdowns, no interceptions. Aikman, however, was 19 of 38, 254 yards, two touchdowns, but two interceptions. Eric Pegram had 21 carries for 144 yards and Bam Morris had 11 carries for 41 yards. With Fred McAfee carrying the ball five times for 12, John L. Williams, three times for 17. Emmett Smith carried the ball 17 times for 58 yards, and Aikman twice for 12. Uh, so, yeah, so there's the stats, and the game, the game story was that Eric Pegram was fantastic as the visitors from Pittsburgh bested Dallas by the score of 27-17, Pegram rushed for 144 yards and added a touchdown. Pittsburgh controlled the ground game, uh, outrushing Dallas 214 to 77. Incredible. They controlled the ball for 34-22. Dallas was on top of top at the half 17-14. Pittsburgh led after three quarters 20 to 17. Aikman threw 38 times for 254 yards and two touchdowns for Dallas. And that's the game story, folks. And I am undefeated in my Super Bowl replays taking the actual losing team. And this time the score came out exactly the same. But the uh, losing team won because, as usual, I was controlling the losing team. So that's very interesting. Um... But that's going to be it for me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off from Super Bowl 30.